How exactly does Michigan dry ice blasting work with Strength H2O Industrial Solutions? The easiest way to understand dry ice blasting is to first consider a consumer pressure washer. An electric pressure washer simply accelerates water with compressed air, then forces the water through a nozzle which creates even more pressure on the surface being cleaned. In the case of a pressure washer the media, used for cleaning surfaces is simply water, however, this process uses a lot of water, which is wasteful and, is a secondary waste to dispose of, and is not effective for cleaning hard to remove stains, coatings, debris, and contaminants. Furthermore, pressurized water can cause damage to fragile and sensitive cleaning surfaces, such as electrical equipment, cables, and precision machined equipment. When using the power of dry ice blasting we take advantage of kinetics and thermodynamics which result as a far superior method of cleaning. The dry ice blasting process in one sentence. When fine CO2 particles are blasted onto a surface, the unwanted contaminants freeze and fracture, then an explosion of energy takes place, resulting in the thorough removal of the unwanted coating, such as grease, paint, and rust. Three rapid effects that occur in milliseconds, stage one effect, thermal shock, the first thermal shock stage of the dry ice blasting process results in the rapid freezing of the surface contaminants, causing them to become brittle and fractured. Stage 2 Effect Impact Shock The dry ice pellets bombard the cleaning surface at a high rate of speed, breaking up the brittle and fractured coating or contaminant. Stage 3 Effect Expansion Shock An explosive event takes place caused by the instant expansion of gas, due to the rapid heat transfer and sublimation of dry ice. This, combined with the impact force of the CO2 pellets, blows away the unwanted surface contaminants, debris, stains, or coatings. Three primary advantages of dry ice blasting. 1. Less surface area damage other methods of cleaning a surface employing the combination of compressed air and media, such as plastic beads, glass beads, sand, aluminum oxide, and silicon carbide, can damage cleaning surfaces by removing more than just the unwanted debris. T is can cause scarring and or delamination. 2. Less environmental impact. Other blast cleaning media are usually not as environmentally responsible, depending on the cleaning technician's process and choice of locations. 3. Employee health and safety. The use of most alternative blast cleaning media, such as glass, sand, plastic, aluminum oxide, silicon carbide, etc., if not used with the proper safety equipment and processes can negatively affect the health of the operators and or others in the immediate area. Schedule a free no obligation today. Call 734-999-0444.